Hey guys, today's video is a master suite deep clean. I left no surface untouched and it felt so good to get an entire section of the house done. I hope that you guys liked today's video and find some motivation. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. I always like to strip the bed and get that going before I start cleaning the room, but that means I have to get the fan dusted off right away so I can take the mattress cover, because the mattress cover is what takes such a long time to dry that it ends up being way past bedtime before it's ready to be put back on. So I'm going to do that, strip it, and then get this laundry out of here and out of the way so I can start dusting everything down. Maybe if I change the way I love it Maybe if I try to fix this heart then I could have stayed the night I could have called you mine If I change the way I Since I'm doing a deep clean, once I get this night all dusted off I'm gonna pull it out so I can get behind and dust off all the wires and then get the baseboard Have you guys noticed that my picture frames have no pictures in them? Um, Josh has confiscated all of our pictures onto his computer and I have no idea how to get to them. So I can get them printed out and put into the frames. So I've just been patiently waiting for him to get it done for me. too bad with dust because I had done them I think maybe two weeks before this but oh my gosh when I did them that time it was horrible there were huge dust bunnies hanging off of them it, I was sneezing because it just kept popping up and getting to me it was so bad What is your favorite glass cleaner? I have not found anything that I really like. I feel like things are okay, but I'm not seeing like streak free or clean or anything that it claims, especially for mirrors. I'm always finding a lot of streaks and I absolutely hate that or it looks cloudy. So if you guys have some recommendations, please comment below and let me know what you love. Like it. 
vacuumed way longer than I normally do in the room. I usually vacuum a couple times a week, um, but I wanted to make sure that I just got in all directions, so I got everything out I possibly could, and I was really surprised by how much I pulled out, given that I do vacuum at least twice a week, if not more. Usually it's pretty much every day, to be honest. carpet and I did it both directions so I can make sure I got to it the best I could. So now I'm just trying to pull really random things out from under the bed but the bed's pretty big and I guess my arms are really short or I don't know I couldn't reach even to the center of the bed so I was using these tongs and I still couldn't get all of it. My collection of goods so far from under my bed. This is a slap bracelet, but it's also a ruler. That would be Jameson. It has been quite a while since I have vacuumed under the bed. So I was not surprised by how much dust and hair I pulled out. It was a lot, really a lot. I need to make sure I do this at least once a week. But it was really great to get it done and just get all of that come out. Everything we need right here. Make me sing along, sing along. I never thought I'd ever be stuck by you. Starting the bathroom, I just wanted to get all the towels out of here so I could get those going after the bedding and it took me a really long time. I had a lot of laundry to do today. I did get a late start on cleaning. I didn't start until like mid-afternoon, so I did not finish the bathroom today. I stopped after dinner time and I did continue the next day. And on the bottom, that's just silicone. It's just kind of rolling up. We need to redo it. But everything else we saw was hard water damage. So I just took my cleaner and I'm really going to scrub in there with the rag and some Q-tips and try to get it all out. So what's left is just some like paint damage. I'm going to get a furniture marker and see if I can fix that. And then it's just again that silicone that needs to be replaced. After I finished laundry, we went out to dinner, and I was so excited when I got back that the mattress cover was done and there was still daylight, because that never happened. So I got that made, had the sheets drying, and then I went back to cleaning the bathroom.
years and I have never used the jets in the tub. So I decided it's finally time to clean them and start using them. I used water and bleach and I'm thinking that probably wasn't the best idea because this created a ton of foam and I'm hoping that it will go away easily. So as I continued cleaning, I would stop in between each thing and I would try to rinse more foam out of the tub. I would probably spend about five minutes per time doing it and it took me the entire time I cleaned the bathroom to get it cleared out. It was such a mess, but I think that the bath is probably pretty clean by now. I spared you guys watching me clean the toilet because I wasn't sure what to expect. I do not use this toilet, it's purely Josh's. I don't come in here very often, but it actually wasn't that bad, so I could have filmed it after all, but oh well. is gone and I'm left with all of this bubble. I have to figure out how to get it out of here. I was very surprised by how little actually came out of the jet, given that I have never cleaned them before. Um, but it was just a little bit of gunk and now it's all done. If we just try, if we just try So come on baby, dive deeper, dive, dive Deeper, yeah, dive deeper, dive, dive With me, yeah, I know we could fly If we just try, baby, try, try, try You find it distracting, hold of our issues Rather die So even though I had all that bleach in there, it just didn't feel right not to scrub it down with some cleaner. So I went ahead and did that, rinsed it and dried it all out, and I think this tub is ready to go.
trying, trying too hard. too hard. Tell me what to do, say anything. top to bottom and nothing left unturned. It feels so great to have it done. I wish I could have it like this all the time. I really hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please consider subscribing. I'd love to have you part of the channel family. And I will see you guys next time. We can do it better, baby, I believe. You can see James in there in the background. He decided to take advantage of a clean tub and brother not being here for the day. Try, try so hard